This can be my I husband. Want you. Really? Yes. <laughs> we just have to go to my apartment and then we can, you know. Ivan? Hi. Andrea, what are you doing here? Just leaving the hospital. Hello. <laughs> I'm Andrea. I'm a friend of Ivan. <gasps> oh, nice to meet you. I'm just Juani, his girlfriend. <laughs> his girlfriend oh <laughs> how wonderful hey that's cute what an amazing couple oh isn't that right <laughs> mm -hmm. yes you look so happy and especially super faithful hey i really like you oh. let's get a coffee sometime <laughs> oh but no what do you say oh, oh andrea what do you mean you must be very busy no no no, not at all. I just finished my work, Shaven. I'm free. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. Then let's go to my apartment. It's just right here. Uh, yeah, perfect. Let's go. <laughs> oh, so amazing. Hey, what a coincidence to run I into you. I know. How did you meet? <laughs> Welcome. Please come and sit while I make you some coffee. I'll help you, Sutor. Thank you. Um, I was just calling to let you know that Ivan went out of town and he'd be out for a few days. <laughs> he asked me to tell you. No, no, that's not what I was going to tell you. Oh, I'm sorry, I have to hang up. See you later. Bye. <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> oh, my love. So glad to see you. Thank you for inviting me over to eat. Hello. You must be Patty, the mother of my best friend. So glad to meet you. Andrea, um, uh, I think I better walk you out uh, so we don't hold you back longer. Uh, yes, let me come with you. Just honey, we'll be right back, okay? But we were about to have a coffee, but... Uh... All right. It was really nice to meet you, Andrea. I hope we can see each other sometime. Let's go. Come on. We'll be right back. Yes, your mama. Come on. Stop. Come on. Uh, stop. Let me go, Ivan. <gasps> How long were you planning to make a fool out of me? Uh, stop. Tone it down a bit. Don't you get it? Every good man has his little chapels. Oh, and be glad that you're the cathedral. Yes, Andrea. Go back to the house and I'll see you in a few days. I can't believe you're overlapping your song with something as serious as infidelity. Enough, honey. Get over it. Listen, my husband always had a lover and I was very happy. Well, yes, because you are just a gold digger that spreads her legs at any sign of someone's with money. You don't let a single one go, Patty. <gasps> Don't you ever say that again, idiot! The apple doesn't fall far from tree. Uh, bye, honey. See you. Let's go, son. Why, what? Why do you do this if I truly loved you? What does a plastic swanny have that I don't? Hey, be careful. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just that I got my heart broken. <laughs> you too? My wife. My wife is being a favorite <laughs> with a cut of a regular with milk skin and jerk muscles. And me with a plastic doll who thinks she's a Kardashian. God, God me damn you, Swanny. That's my Angutan. Well, what? They made a fool out of us. I just realized today. I saw them kissing each other out in public. I wish we could get back at those two assholes. Hey, yeah, we can. I have an idea.
Mother-in-law! Don't tell me you came to see my partner. Andrea. Well, yeah. And now what do you want? Oh, no, I won't take much time from you. I just wanted to let you know your stuff and events. You can find them in the street. Oh, and I changed the locks. And also you have a restraining order, so you won't get close. Andrea. But, sweetheart, what do you mean? I've always seen you as a daughter. You can't do this to me. Oh, but you could make a fool out of me, right? <sighs> Listen, Patty, I feel sorry for you. Among women, we must support each other, not step one each other. So then, now, I hope you enjoy the streets. You idiot! This won't stay like this! I'm going to sue you, and I'll get back my house! <laughs> well, good luck with that, Patty, because it's my house. My parents left it as my inheritance, and you two just took advantage. <sighs> now you, your son, and Josuani can go together to the streets. Goodbye, dear mama. Mm, that idiot! Honey, come on, get up. You're going to be late for work. No, my love. Today I decided to stay at home. <laughs> Ivan is about to arrive, and my stupid husband will leave. Besides, I have a little surprise for you. It's a surprise that women your type really like. Oh, yeah? And why didn't you tell me anything? <laughs> because it's a surprise, silly head. You really like to spoil me. Well, who am I to prevent it, right? Mm -hmm. Come. Let's go. Come on, but it's a surprise. Walk. All right, my love. You can look now. Hello, Josuani. Why are you here, Andrea? <laughs> well... You know her? What kind of joke is this, Hosh? I want to fulfill one of my biggest fantasies. Hold on, I, I don't even know her. What kind of person do you think I am to get involved with someone other than you? But you just mentioned her name, my love. <laughs> of course, we know each other. We all four share saliva. We are very close. I don't know what this lady is talking about. Honey, I'm here. I hope you're waiting for me with your clothes off. Uh, Andrea, why are you here? So then you are the famous Ivan. <laughs> My love, I've been looking for you. I didn't know you were with your friend Josuani, and this was my last option. I was very worried. Oh, get the crab already. What? Ivan, you're married then? Why do you do this to me? Well, yeah, because none of this would happen if you weren't impunted in bed. I needed someone to make me feel like the female I am. And what's better than a man with money? <laughs> oh, sweetheart, the house is mine. Ivan doesn't have a single penny. You were just a simple snack he had along the way. What? Ivan... You told me that money was yours, and now it turns out a simple nurse is the rich one? A simple head of nurses, from the most renowned and recognized hospital, with an income of over 500k a year. Ah, oh, Jaswani, Jaswani, I want you to get over here. Hmm? And you won't take anything, because everything you have is thanks to me. You're all assholes! And you, Ivan? I'm sure your mother is looking for you in some junkyard, searching for a place in the street to live on. My love, please, you can't do this to me. You're the only beam of light in my pitch dark life. You can't leave me without money. Expect the divers paper soon. And don't worry, I won't take anything from you. Because you've never had anything. You'll never find someone like me. Did you hear me? Never! 
Andrea, thanks a lot for opening my eyes so I could make this decision. I want to thank you too. And I hope that from now on we can become good friends. They say sometimes a relationship is blind and that true love are gifts. But the correct way of saying it is... True love doesn't betray. Don't let people make fun of you. And if that ever happens, remember that you're enough. And that you have the value. No matter the size of the rock. One coffee? <laughs> Some tequila. <laughs>